Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Assembly Member Michael Cusick. Hi, young Democrats. It's great to join you tonight. I am uh, Mike Cusick, State Assemblyman from Staten Island, representing the 63rd Assembly District, County of Richmond County. And uh, my, my young Dem credentials go back a ways, but I am also a former state president of the Young Democrats and a former president of the Richmond County Young Democrats. So I am honored to be here and to, to join you here tonight. And I wanna thank all Young Democrats throughout the state for all your hard work. This is a very crucial year for us, for this state, for this country. And I know that all of you are working very hard and I really truly appreciate your work. And I join with you as we go on to victory on November 3rd. So thank you for your hard work, New York State Young Democrats. I had the great honor tonight, the State Young Democrats asked me to uh, serve tonight in a capacity of introducing and recognizing the Chapter of the Year Award for the New York State Young Democrats. Uh, and I am honored as the Richmond County, uh, County Chairman and as the former president of the Young Dems of Richmond County to announce and introduce the Richmond County Young Democrats as the chapter of the year for the New York State Young Democrats. I wanna congratulate uh, Casey and, and the, all the officers of the Staten Island Young Democrats. I know firsthand, I see firsthand the hard work that they put in, how they've grown our club, how they're an integral part of our county committee uh, all members of the county committee. They're not just the Young Democratic Club. They are integral members of our party on Staten Island. And for that, they truly deserve this award and they truly deserve all of the honors that they may receive going forward. And I know they're putting in the hard work as all of you are. So congratulations, Young Democrats of Richmond County. You make us all proud. Ladies and gentlemen, accepting the award for this Richmond County Young Democrats, their president, Casey Higgins. Uh, thank you so much, Jovan and Assemblymember Cusick. Uh, it's really something to see a Young Democrats past president rise up to become an assembly member and a chair of our local party. Uh, thank you for all of your support over the years, and I really look forward to expanding our Democratic majority on Staten Island. Um, congratulations to all the honorees. It is a serious honor for our chapter to be awarded uh, next to all of these amazing people. Uh, thank you to Jovan and Tyler and Stephanie and Brian, uh, Seamus, and everyone at New York State Young Democrats for all your support of our chapter. Um, and of course, I have to thank my mom who uh, came onto this Zoom call to uh, celebrate us. And she's always been a staunch advocate of uh, the Staten Island Young Democrats. Uh, so, you know, in my time with the Staten Island Young Dems, I've seen the power of young people bring to our politics. Our organization is constantly fundraising and knocking doors and making calls and training new political activists and getting people involved. But then on top of that, our young people are everywhere. Since I've started, I've seen our members get jobs on every one of our elected campaigns or in their offices. And we've seen them organize in, with so many different organizations around getting out the count on Staten Island um, with the census. And you know, we even have you know, a couple of UFT members in our ranks you know, doing the labor organizing within our, uh, within our union, uh, myself and Dana. Um, and you know, out in Staten Island, we really know what it means to be Democrats because we are the only swing borough in New York City. I will never call us a red district, um, but we are the only swing borough. So we had a lot of pressure on us um, to be successful each election season. All eyes on our, are on us. And yet no matter the outcome, somehow the other boroughs are making memes about us still. And I don't really understand why, but you know, we saw in 2018 what happens when the Democratic Party comes together. Not only did Max Rose win New York 11, but we elected Matt to tone to the surrogate court judge on Staten Island and Max Rose won Staten Island. Not even, forget for the part of Brooklyn that he's in, Max Rose won Staten Island. So we need to remember that we, we can do it as an island and we can do it as a democratic party on Staten Island. And I'm so proud of the work that the young Democrats have done. We've done since 2018, all through 2020, we're doing the work and we're getting it done right now. 
Um, and now I would never be successful as a president without the support of our amazing executive board. Um, my vice president, Dana uh, Kanigsberg, who is my like, right-hand person. She does everything with me. Um, our campaign guru, Nidhi Khanna, our amazing policy expert, Veneri, um, our community leader, Lou, our graphics queen, uh, Kayla, who has been just pumping out awesome voting graphics and stuff lately. And of course, our past president, Tommy Blancero, who has been a constant uh, source of support for me. And just all the young Dems are really getting it done. Um, so we aren't, the, we aren't just the future of our party. We know we're the president. Um, and we really have an important get out the vote season, not just across the country, but right in our backyard in New York. So let's make sure that we're not only getting out the vote across the whole country, but we're getting out the vote up and down the ticket for Democrats all across New York State. Thank you so much.